lifestyle lovers welcome back to it's e lifestyle and if you are new here welcome my name is erica my channel is called it's e lifestyle and it's all about creating a good lifestyle okay lifestyle lovers so i just wanted to go ahead and start the vlog off i actually have an appointment to go into the design center for graystones kitchens here in jacksonville i don't know why i'm out of breath y'all i've been working all day my daughter she's actually getting ready to um to leave she came over and helped me film two uh two sponsorship videos and she took my mirror i used to have a mirror right there that i diy'd so every time she comes over here she's taking something <laughs> but anyway um i have an appointment they came like a few weeks ago and took some measurements of my kitchen so basically once they do that you go into to their design center and kind of play around using um you know using their designs how you want your kitchen to be so um that's pretty much what i'm doing on the on the agenda for day for today <laughs> i may stop into the mall because i do have a coupon that i want to use that expires today and that's pretty much it on the last vlog i left off telling you guys i, I was going to show you some items and i didn't so I am going to do that in this vlog. It'll probably be tomorrow though. But um, so I just wanted to start off the vlog. I'm going to show you what I'm wearing. Okay, lifestyle lovers. So I have on a Doshe and Gabbana crop top. This is like a tunic from Express. And then I have on the Doshe and Gabbana like high waist underwear. And then I have on some biker shorts. So it kind of gives the illusion that this is one piece, but it's actually two. It's the Dolce & Gabbana underwear and just some black um, biker shorts. So um, I think I shared this probably like a month or two ago just to kind of save yourself a couple of hundred dollars. The Dolce & Gabbana leggings are probably about $800. So if you kind of do this hack and just buy the underwear, which I think are like $200, and just add your own black leggings, you save yourself $500. So if you want to go buy the seven eight hundred dollar leggings, be my guest. I'm not gonna do that. So this is basically how I created this look. And then on my feet, I have my Dolce and Gabbana Sorrento sneakers. So just nice. It's a nice day outside. So I'm just kind of, you know, keeping it casual, keeping it comfortable. I have on my e necklace, which is. From Amazon I will link this in the description box it's also in my Amazon store just some huge hoops I don't know where they're from and Michael Kors watch ring which is from Pandora my daughter bought me this for my 40th birthday I think near you out now yes come tell the lifestyle lovers hey I just opened the vlog <laughs> hi lifestyle lovers so she's getting ready to leave, but she she was like my camera lady today. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I appreciate that. But she's studying for her final exam. Mm -hmm. Final exam. So she took some time out of her day to come help her mommy. Yes, of course. <laughs> create some content. She took some stuff with her too. So you got paid, baby. <laughs> <laughs> got me a nice vanity mirror. Look at you. So you got everything? Yes. I'll see you later. Bye, lifestyle lovers. Wish me luck on my test. She gonna knock it out. Love the you. Yeah, this time I got to. Okay, I'll call you later. Okay, love All you. Right. Okay, love you too. Okay, lifestyle lovers. So let's get out the door. So yeah, I'm excited to to do this kitchen design. But I am gonna. Yes, yeah, that you got you. Did you get that um perfume tray? No, where's that? It's on the counter. She got another bottle of perfume. <laughs> she got a perfume tray and a vanity mirror. But um, I did some like, uh, kind of like a soft makeover in here. I sold some furniture, but you prop, you guys either have already seen that or you'll see, see it in another video. But I do need to get out the door, so I'll catch you guys either in the car or at the design center. Okay, lifestyle lovers, so I made it in the car. It's such a nice day today. 
but we're gonna get a cold front tonight. So it's gonna be freezing rain, freezing and raining tomorrow. So anyway, lifestyle lovers, I'm quite sure you've seen on the last vlog where I was telling you guys, dang, I think I left my lipstick, while I was telling you um, that I had to fire my contractor. Oh no, I have it. Um, I have on the Sephora, always red on my lips. But I think I was telling you guys on the last vlog where I had to fire my contractor. Um, so I still have not gotten my staircase done. It's still, you know, in demolition mode. And he was real, you know, apologetic and real nice and everything about it. And that's all fine and well, but this is business. But I'm gonna get it done. It's gonna be done right. And I'm gonna be dealing with somebody that's professional. I ain't got time for that ghetto foolishness. No, I ain't got time for that. You showing up late, baby. Don't show up at all. How about that? One of my nails came off, so I was looking for another nail. I kind of keep my nails in the car, so if one falls off. But, um, so yeah, I probably got like a 30 minute drive. So I'm gonna go ahead, turn on some tunes, and get to where I need to be. I could just choose from any. I, I really like this for the eyes and yeah. Okay, so this is all of the quartz. Mm -hmm. Well, we got more. Another rack up here. Some other racks towards the back. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Yeah. Here you go. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, I gotcha. So now will these affect the price at all? Nope. Okay. It's everything is yeah. I gotcha. Okay, cool. Okay. I'm gonna take my quote. Okay, lifestyle lovers, so my apologies. I was under the impression that I was going to be, you know, they were going to do like an interactive consultation in which I could, with the design of my kitchen, because they had like a whole draw out of my kitchen. So um, I don't understand what was the point of me coming way out here for y'all to give me a write up. They could have did that through email, but the price is like $10,000. And um, I found them when I went to the home and patio show months and months ago. So they said I won some type of contest where I could get a certain percentage off. So with that certain percentage off is $8,900. I won't be going with them. <laughs> I've already, uh, this is like my second quote. I got a quote from another countertop place, which is called Granite Countertops. And I used them before in my first home because I switched the countertops out to granite countertops when I purchased my first house, you know, back when I was in my 20s. And um, they came out and I want to say they told me like $3,000 and some change. Um, but this is like, this is crazy. So I keep all my quotes. I'll have to go back to that quote from, from the place is called Noble Granite. But I'll have to go back to that quote and kind of compare um, what they have. I know they have a sink on here and all that stuff, but I don't have to get a sink from them. I was just really wanting the countertops, but I'm not spending $10,000. If it don't include the floors and all of that, I'm not spending $10,000 for no countertops. Child, please. So this was a waste. So I'm gonna head to the mall and get my ass back home.
think I like this one. What's the difference between the two? I smelled that one. Oh, they both have different scents. That's the one I like. Yeah. Yeah, I like this one. It's sweet. I like that. I smell a little different when I when I like the packaging too. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna drop that in there. Oh, that one smells good too. What's the difference between them? Do you know? So with this one, this one, both of them, both of them are pop bones. Um, this one has ingredients of vanilla, so that's why it's a little bit more sweeter than this one. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. I don't want to spend a whole lot of money. Cause <laughs> Let me get the 1.7. Perfume. More perfume. I got like too much lifestyle lovers so i made it out the mall i only went in two stores so i have a another bottle of perfume which smells really really good i'm overdoing it on the perfume but whatever so my stomach is growling i'm so hungry i'm gonna get me something to eat i'm gonna get me some wine and um i do have a new pair of nikes that i want to share with you guys and then a nike outfit I may not share that tonight. It'll probably be tomorrow. So either I'll check back in with you guys once I get home. If not, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, lifestyle lovers. Happy MLK Day. So today is Monday. It's Martin Luther King Day. We're sitting in the car. We just got to the location for the MLK parade. My son is gonna be stepping in the parade it's really early it's probably about it's a little bit after seven and i think <clears throat> what time the parade start huh i don't know what time the parade start but um but yeah so we're just sit sitting in the car waiting on instruction it's cold today somebody told me to stop saying it's cold at, at four to five degrees but but Florida is cold. It's cold. So, um, but I think it's going to warm up. And as we start, you know, moving and stuff like that, I think, you know, I think we'll warm up. My son's in the back trying to get his last little bit of sleep. So I'm going to be one of the parents in the parade doing whatever, passing out flyers or, or whatever. So I will be participating as well. So I'll try to like catch some footage. Um, I'll try to like catch some footage of the different uh you know the different stuff in the parade it's it's you know it's in downtown jacksonville that's where the parade is typically held i see there go uh 904 okay lifestyle lover so i check back in um i check back in later i just wanted to go ahead and tell you guys good morning i did not vlog yesterday you guys know i like the rest so i just kind of chilled did some Sunday reset and then I return to work tomorrow. So this is like a holiday off day for me. But um, but I'll check in with you guys and kind of show you, you know, a little bit of the parade festivities. Y'all, the things that we do for our kids, it is windy and cold as heck out here today. 
So I'm sitting in the car. I'm waiting on them to um to pass by so I can jump in. But it's 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 windy. I mean it's cold, but the wind makes it e even worse. And I really want to go back home, but you know that's not fair to my son. And I agree, you know, to you know be in the parade as a parent. But I'm just trying to get as much heat as I can. That's why I'm sitting in the car waiting on them to pass where I'm parked at. And then I'm going to go ahead and jump in. I do have on a parent t-shirt. Um, but I can't even take off my sweatshirt. It's just too cold. I tried to take it off. But it's it's just it's too cold. So, uh, yeah. It's like a mile and a half long. So, it shouldn't be too bad. But I'm getting my steps in today because I haven't been walking lately because it, it's, it, it has gotten so cool. <sighs> Y'all, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Okay, lifestyle lovers, so we survived. We made it back home. My son, he's upstairs playing his PlayStation and I am exhausted. I got up at like 6 a.m. so I can feel it catching up with me. So I'm about to take me a nap, but not before I eat because I did not eat breakfast. I got up and I fixed my son some waffles for breakfast, but it was too early for me to eat, so I didn't eat. And I'm hungry. The only thing that I've had all day since we got up was a cookie that I purchased when we were downtown. So I wanted to share this recipe with you guys that I probably ate like five or six times last week because it was so good. My son, he wanted Hamburger Helper. He loves Hamburger Helper. So um, I got his Hamburger Helper on the, so on the stove. It's already done, matter of fact. It's already done because when I get in my bed, I don't want to be bothered. So that is lunch and dinner. Um, but I bought like a bag of salmon from Walmart. And I went back to see if they had more and they didn't. But it was made by the brand Seabest. And it has about, which is a seafood company. But it had about six um, portion size salmons in there and I think I made this recipe with all six because it was so good so if you love salmon and you love salad you're gonna definitely love this it's simple it reminds me of something that you'll probably pay about $20 at a restaurant and you can make it at home so I've already seasoned my salmon I seasoned it with lemon pepper accent Old Bay and garlic powder and I'm gonna cook it in the air fryer if you have never had salmon in the air fryer, you don't know what you're missing. So I cook it anywhere between 11 and 13 minutes, depending on the size of the salmon. So I think I'm going to do this probably about 12 minutes. I'm 
I'm just going to place the salmon on the tray because I don't have any foil or anything to line it with. And then I have this garlic and herb butter. So I'm just going to place a few pieces of the garlic and herb butter on the salmon. So this is basically how it looks before I put it in the air fryer. Okay, lifestyle lovers, so I have some spring mix here. I'm just going to sprinkle it with some lemon pepper seasoning. And then I'm going to add some roasted and salted sunflower seeds. I'm just going to place my salmon right on top kind of fell apart a little bit. But I'm just gonna place it right on top of the spring mix. And then I'm gonna add some lemon and herb dressing only to the spring mix. So when I eat it, I just break off the salmon, dip it in some of my spring mix with the dressing. It's so good. I'm all in the camera with my mouth open chewing. But it's so good, lifestyle lovers. So if you try this recipe, let me know how you like it and what you think. It has a kick to it with the lemon and herb dressing and the lemon pepper seasoning. And a little crunch, a little saltiness with the um, sunflower seeds. It's so good. So I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this i'm going to take me a nap once i get up i'm going to share some things that i purchased this weekend with you guys and then we'll go ahead and close out the vlog this is actually my parent shirt it says 904 blitz 2022 and i will um i will be sure to place their um ig handle across the screen so if you are here in jacksonville and you want to look into it for your son or your nephew or whoever, a young black male, you want to get them involved in something. It starts at the third grade all the way up to the 12th grade. So just reach out to them through IG and um and yeah. So I'll check back in with you guys later. I'm tired, so let me give me some rest. Hey lifestyle lovers. So it's actually a few days later. I really did not want this vlog to be as long as it is, but there are some things that I want to share with you guys before I close out the vlog. Just some purchases this week i have some perfume some of the items were purchased in this vlog and some of the items just kind of like arrived today so i wanted to share those items with you one of the first things that i want to share is a pair of jordans that i just recently purchased and these are the jordan ones mid mmd I don't know what the the name means for these Jordans. I just seen these on Nike.com and I fell in love with them. So I purchased them. They were $105 and I purchased them in the size 5. It is a kid's shoe. So a 5 kids and women is like a 7. And I'm anywhere between a 7 and a 7 and a half depending on the shoe. So these are the ones that I purchased. They have like a some grid lines on them in different colors. You got yellow, you got blue. Looks like some uh, peach in there. I can't wait to wear these. But I purchased these one night. I was just up, couldn't sleep, having insomnia, scrolling on my phone, and I found these and ordered them immediately. And also, when I was in the mall a few days ago, I went into Foot Locker and I purchased a Nike outfit. I'm not gonna try it on, but I will show you how it looks on the model. So these are some sweatpants. I purchased them in the size small and it has like the swoosh check on them. And I also purchased a 
swoosh Nike crop top to go with the sweatpants. So most likely I'll be wearing this outfit along with my new Jordan. And also when I was in the mall, I purchased the Oscar de la Renta Bella Blanca out of Dillard's. I had a coupon for Dillard's during the time that I was shopping during the holidays for $50 off any cosmetics. So I paid less than $40 for this perfume. It smells so good and the packaging is just gorgeous. And also what arrived today was this Jimmy Choo I Love Choo, which smells so, so good. I think I'm gonna spray this today because I have not sprayed anything, but I smelled this during the holidays as well, and it was between this and the MCM, and the, the packaging on the MCM actually is what sold me, as well as the scent, but this one smells really, really good. So if you are looking for a good perfume recommendation for Valentine's Day, this is it. It smells so, so good. So I'm so happy to add this to my collection. And last but not least, this also came in the mail yesterday. This is a personal microdermabrasion tool. I have been doing some, you know, reviews as to how to get rid of hyperpigmentation. So I am going to try this. This particular tool is not a quick fix. It takes like eight to 12 weeks before you see results and it was not cheap. So I am going to use this once a week on my skin throughout the winter and throughout the spring. I'll definitely give you guys an update if I notice any visible results. Most of you know I am on a healthy skincare journey. So I am willing to try anything to get my skin back to its original state. And it is probably about 70% better than it was two weeks ago, but I want it to be like 100%. I want an even healthy skin tone. So hopefully this will help me achieve that. Okay, lifestyle lovers. So that is it for this week's vlog. I apologize that it was so long. Any of the items that I mentioned in this video will be in the description box. If you're not subscribed, be sure to subscribe before you leave. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.